Hey everyone, QB King 77 here with the Android Police team here to do a full review video on the Beach Buggy Blitz Android application. This application is brought to you by Vector Unit. You may be familiar with some of their other works such as Riptide GP and Shine Runner, other very popular games found in the Google Play Store. This game in particular is free. So you can find it in the Google Play Store. Uh, you will also notice right away that it is unfortunately only available on Tegra 3 and some Tegra 2 devices. I am on my Nexus 7 at the moment, uh, able to play this game, but keep in mind, hopefully in the near future, they will update it to work on other various devices. But at the moment, only take it through Tegra 3 and Tegra 2. So let's go ahead and get into it. Uh, hit touch to play and it will load up. You'll see loading times aren't long. Uh, graphics are very smooth, no choppiness, no lagginess. Uh, but right here, you are greeted with the main menu. You'll see in the upper left-hand corner letting you know what your high score is, which is the main goal, what you want to beat. Of course, upper right-hand corner lets you know how many coins you do have. Some news, you have some settings, and down here you have play and various power-ups and upgrades. So right away, uh, you do have other ways that you can play. You can change audio, but you do have controls that you can change. You can touch sides of the screen to, t to steer. You can also touch arrows to steer. There's also an option for a gamepad and tilting. So you can tilt your uh, device left and right and it will use the accelerometer to steer. So that's a cool way to do it, but I'm not going to show that just because this is a video. So I'm gonna use touch A where you just touch the sides of the screen. You can also change some of the graphics, community and credits, those are all in the settings. Uh, but down here, you have various power-ups. Before I do get into power-ups, I do kinda want to overview and talk about the game itself. So we can go ahead and hit play. You will see right away, goes right to the start. It's not a race, it's basically your own personal goal to get as far as you can. So I'm gonna to touch the sides of the screen to steer. You will see there are coins on the levels and getting collecting these coins is how you can uh, eventually get further and further within the levels. So you will collect coins, you will go off jumps, you will try and avoid everything. Uh, you don't wanna run into trees, you don't wanna run into houses. You don't want to run into these various objects that I'm running into just because it will slow you down. So you want to avoid as many things as possible. You will see there are other cars out there. Um, you're not necessarily racing against them, but you don't want to run into them at all just because it will slow you down. Uh, so you just kind of want to avoid them, but keep collecting coins. Uh, what's, what's great about it is um, it's not repetitive. So. Uh, some games you'll see you play the same level over and over and over with this it's not there's not necessarily uh, levels where you progress through the game but every time you do run through it is a different uh, level it looks different you run through go off different jumps you'll see this is a pretty big ramp right here I'm gonna go off of and go through another uh, tunnel you'll see when you go into tunnels your headlights do turn on so you can actually see which is actually just a little neat graphical feature that they have included Otherwise, as you progress through the level, you will see um, it does get a little bit more challenging with uh, various obstacles. You can collect double the amount of coins with these. Uh, in the upper left-hand corner is your time. You'll see I just ran out of time, but I got to the, uh, the checkpoint that you basically want to get to every time to continue to go. In the upper right-hand corner, it lets you know how far you have gone. As you can see, very nice graphic with the uh, when going into water. It, it's just like it's raining in your car. Uh, if you do happen to tip over like this, there's a reset button right there that you can hit re reset. Unfortunately, I tipped over right at the end there. Uh, but obviously, you can reset that. Let's me know my distance, coins collected, and my total score. So in the bottom right, you'll see I have 514 coins. You can hit get upgrades. And here is basically what you use these coins for. So coins give you upgrades and upgrades help you to get a higher uh, high score. So you can upgrade your beach buggy itself. You'll see I've gotten a dune jumper, so I upgraded that. You have various other ones as well, all having different statistics that are shown there. You have different characters that you can be. You'll see that uh, obviously those all cost coins as well so the more you do play the more coins you do collect the more upgrades you can get and the further you can get on the level so here are power-ups you will notice that there are power-ups i have unlocked boost and checkpoint so uh, what boost can do is obviously make you go faster you can also get shield coin magnet coin bubble those circles pop up and you collect them just like coins while you are on your run 
and you also have gadgets right here. So you have gadgets, drop ship, what it does is it basically drops you further, so you'll start either 1,000 meters, 5,000 meters in front of where you normally do, so it gives you a bit of a head start, and you have extra lives as well. Uh, overall, the game is very addictive. I find myself do playing it a lot. I, I, I like to see how far I can get, how many of these cars I can unlock. You see, I can un unlock one if I'd like to, so if I wanted to unlock this Lambini right here, I can just hit unlock, and there we go. I am now uh, riding in it. You can actually change the color of it if you don't like that yellow. So let's change it to green. Actually, no, let's go ahead and go to blue. So go ahead and hit the forward arrow, and then you can choose your decal as well. I can just use that, no big deal. Choose the pedal color and paint car. Oh, so it does cost coins to paint car. I did not know this. So you do have to pay to paint your car, which I can't afford at the moment. So unfortunately, I'm unable to change my paint color. So again, uh, very important to collect as many coins as possible. As you saw, I can continue to play, but overall, you will notice that some things do look similar. The beginning itself looks very uh, similar just because obviously when you start, you wanna try and have it look similar. But once you get further and further in the level, things do change. You'll see giant crabs do come up that you do have to avoid. Various ramps, various coins to collect. There are also hidden things that you need to find. Uh, there's actually a list of those hidden things that you can find. You can take these quick shortcuts and you'll see I just got the boost power up so it is making me go faster. You try, you'll try. you see I got a little stuck in the water. I didn't go fast enough over that jump. Uh, so there's a little problem there. But if I wanted to exit and go back to the main menu, I can. And I do want to show you guys there are hidden places that you can go to get more experience and more uh, coins and such. I believe you can tap, tap on high score and you'll see there's objectives. So you can discover swamp area, discover volcano area, unlock a car, mechanic upgrade a car. So there's various things that give you bonus percentages, lets you know your high scores and stats as well. Uh, so you'll see you have a basic career that you want to try and unlock everything. I am 7% done. Um, so yeah, uh, overall very fun, definitely a game you want to check out. Uh, hopefully it gets uh, support for various de more devices in the future. But definitely let me know what you think. Be sure to leave a comment. Be sure to subscribe as well. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. All links will be in the description of the video below. And as always, thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up.